One of the key benefits of paying into a pension is that pensions are a really tax efficient way of saving for your long term future. This is because you usually get tax relief on your own pension contributions, which reduces their cost. Tax relief means you get back some of the tax you paid on your earnings when you pay into your pension. That's why they can be such an effective way to save for your retirement. Tax benefits can be applied in a number of different ways. You can check with your pension provider how this works for the type of pension you're in. One way is through what is known as tax relief at source. This will apply if you either pay your own contributions from your bank account or your employer deducts them from your after income tax earnings. This means if you pay an £80 contribution, the government tops this up to £100, so you get 20% basic rate tax relief. With this type of pension, you usually get 20% tax relief even if you don't pay tax or pay the Scottish 19% starter rate. If you pay any income tax at a higher rate than 20%, you need to claim the rest of your tax relief, usually by completing a self-assessment tax return. With some other types of workplace pensions, your employer deducts your pension contributions from your earnings before working out your income tax. This is known as net pay tax relief. This reduces the cost of contributing £100 to £80 if you pay tax at the 20% basic rate tax, or to £60 if you pay at the 40% higher rate tax, and so on. At the moment, low earners in Scotland might only get 19% tax relief rather than 20%. And it's worth remembering, you don't get any tax relief on contributions paid out of the income within the personal allowance, which is currently £12,570. If this affects you, the government has announced that you'll be able to claim a top-up equivalent to the tax relief you miss out on from 2025 to 2026. But this won't cover tax years before 2024 to 2025. Finally, there's salary exchange. In this scenario, you agree to reduce your earnings in exchange for your employer increasing the pension contributions it makes for you. As a result, you don't pay tax or national insurance on the amount you've exchanged. If you pay any extra contributions outside of the salary exchange, you would get tax relief on these amounts in line with the type of pension scheme you're in.